have to share this with you guys. You know when you say, this guy has a six pack, what does it refer to? This guy has a six pack. What's the first thing that comes to your mind? For me, it means he's quite fit. Perhaps he goes to the gym, he does a bit of weightlifting, he does some exercise, some stretches and a combination of all of that. And so he's got his abs in order and he, it's showing like a six pack, you know. And sometimes we tease people and say, well, you know, I have just one big family pack because it sounds like you're buying maybe soft drinks or something. But did you know that a six pack in some parts of the world refers to alcohol, to beer? So when someone says, this guy has a six pack, you know, they are talking about booze, they're talking about alcohol. So you, it comes in packs of six. And the strange thing is, when you have one big round belly, some people call it a beer belly because those who drink beer, uh, we're not referring here to the Muslimin amongst us because we hope that we wouldn't be drinking. But those who drink beer, sometimes when they excessively drink, apparently they develop a, be a big belly, you know, one big family pack. So, <laughs> And that's called a beer belly. So when you say a six pack, it's either to do with uh, six compartments of within your abs and so on or it's to do with alcohol so the reason why I was laughing at this is because sometimes you can get confused you don't know what language is used in some parts of the world so be careful not all six packs are actually six packs it's different it depends where you are and who you're talking to and what the context of your speech is so inshallah, be careful of that one and others. If you know any other confusions that occur like this, put it down in the comments inshallah on my YouTube channel and inshallah I'll try and see them and acknowledge that I've seen them. Because there are a lot of times when you say something and it actually means something totally different that's embarrassing in another culture or another region, another part of the world. Subhanallah. I'll tell you another one next time. Mashallah. In the meantime, Assalamu Alaikum Warahmatullah.